Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. We see them, we see them booing President Hakai Meishirem. So this is not just, no, it is because your view, because you are in exile, now or whatever, whatever. No. Leave me, leave me aside. What about the people that booed uh, Haka in the Ishinema at the Independence Stadium? Why did they, at the Hero Stadium, why did they boo him? Because they are not happy. They are not happy. At no, Emmanuel Mwamba planted a few people to, uh, to boo uh, uh, to, to, to boo uh, President Haka in the Hichire. Meanwhile, they are saying, no, no, no one booed him. But one side, you are summoning someone. You want to arrest somebody that you, you organize people to boo the president. On one side, you are saying, no, no one booed him. <laughs> Imagine. What crazy, how crazy is that? And we have the videos. Haka in the Hichire now is it He's choosing where to go carefully. He's choosing where to go carefully. People are, they are booing him. People are expressing their displeasure. We saw even somewhere there, I don't know if in the Copa Belt when the, the convoy was passing. Yeah. People are shouting, unga, 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 unga. People are not happy. So I'm not just, I don't believe that what I'm talking about here, that he, the church seemed to be compromised. I don't think I'm just speaking for myself here. There is evidence that there are people who are not happy. So if people are shouting, when they see Haka in the HDMI, they shout, they say, no, 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 come on, not this. How come you, the church leaders are finding it so comfortable, so nice, so uh, convenient to meet this man and take pictures like models Yes, you can go and see him. But show us that you are speaking for us, Allah. Show us that you are speaking for us. Can we see some change in this man? If we don't see change, at least can we? Can we know that at least you are trying? I mean, that's why somehow I'm agreeing with the, a Archbishop Teres from Pundo Emeritus. Because him... He comes out, that's why somehow I like him. It's not that I agree with him, you know. These are on national matters. I don't agree with him all the time in everything. But at least he comes out to say, no, I, we, you know, like he, he, we had that meeting. They, they had that meeting with Osida. And he came out, he said, look, we went there. We had that meeting, but he spoke more than us. We never said anything. He couldn't hear us. So whilst he... Archbishop Therese from Pundu is saying this. I mean, we are seeing our bishops very comfortable. I mean, it's being called Lucifer's. In one of your statements, you are demanding that the, 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 the government apologizes for calling uh, one of your own Lucifer's. Has he apologized? He hasn't apologized. And yet, you find it comfortable, you know, to come to stand and take pictures with him. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? And people are complaining. Young people are protesting. We want electricity. We want electricity. And some of them are being arrested. Do you even know if those people, those young people who were arrested have been released? Do you even know what is the status? You know a number of your, of your faithful. Some of you have even gone to visit them in, in, in prison. You have never visited me. But you have visited some of these people in prisons. What is their status? Are you okay with that? These are the things that are making these Zambian people to boo. 
Hakainde Ichilema and his ministers. It is, it is an evidence that people are not happy with this leadership. And yet, you are giving an impression that you are comfortable with this leadership. Well, I'm not saying you should start campaigning against the Haka in the Ichinema. No, that is not for you. You are not politicians. You are not politicians. But we are talking about showing it, speaking it, and showing it that you are not happy about certain things. I am not saying speak against a, a, a campaign, decampaign a Haka in the Ichinema. I'm not saying that. I am saying that, please, can you show us that you are not happy with the people? If yourself you are comfortable, but at least you as shepherds of the people, can you express what people are talking about? Can you bring those desires of people? Can you bring the aspirations of the people? Can you give us hope for goodness sake? Can you give us hope? People would not be booing Haka in the Hichilema and his ministers if they are okay. Haka in the Ichilema is being booed. Haka in the Ichilema cannot just move around it anyhow. People will boo him. People will, are, begin, are, are, are expressing their displeasure. Even my good poor minister, she's very good, that, uh, uh, that lady. I love that lady. Eh? I, I, I really love that lady. I'm telling you, the, the justice minister. I, I love that lady and I have, I have so much respect for her. I have so much respect for you, Mama. I have so much respect for you. Unfortunately, you know, you are working in a government that is a disaster. And look, you were delivering that message. You were talking and people were listening to you because you are a good leader yourself. Yeah? Yeah. Princess Kasune, you are a good leader. And people were listening to you. The moment you mentioned Haka in the HDM, everything went sour. And you thought you didn't hear it right. You repeated it. You tried to, to change your statement and you put it nicely that you're hoping that people will accept it. But just listening to the word Haka into the name Haka in the HLMA, people are indignified. The name Haka in the HLMA abhors them. They don't, they don't want to hear it. And this is a message to all of you. Be very careful when you go out there. Don't mention Haka in the HDM. You mention Haka in the HDM, people get upset. And this is why I'm telling my bishops and the other leaders that be careful when you are taking those pictures. Because just seeing those pictures, you standing with Haka in the HDM like that, a lot of people are not feeling very, very comfortable. So be very careful. Kasune was not, was not booed by herself, no. She was booed because she mentioned, you know, in, in a way of appreciating somebody that has appointed her to be minister. They were not happy. They were not happy. People, Haka, uh, Haka in the HDM, no. You remember, even uh, there was also, uh, you know, even Haka in the HDM himself, he was talking in church. The moment he mentioned Edgar Chagwalungu, people stood up. Yeah? In applause, they were not applauding Haka in the HDM for saying, No, I'm going to uh, I'm going to engage in dialogue. They know that Haka in the HDM is a liar, they know. But it's because he mentioned Edgar Chagwalungu and they applauded. They applauded him. So, of course, this is not to say Edgar Chagwalungu is innocent, he's not. It's not to say he's an is a saint, he's not. But I'm basically showing or making a comparison of how people are perceiving these leaders, how people are perceiving uh, Haka Inde Ishlem, how people are perceiving Edgar Chagwalungu. So it is very clear people are not happy. People are not happy. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. Alright, that's all for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutati Mpondu. I love you, peace. I gotta go.